it's AIM again, and we're back with the Youth Collab Springboard Program. Now, the important thing of pitches is that most people get three things wrong. One is the problem statement. If you don't have a problem that investors really resonate with, they understand, they can uh, sense that this is a really big market opportunity, something that people would be willing to pay a ton of money for, everything you talk about in the pitch doesn't matter. They don't think there's a business opportunity. Now, a lot of people end up underselling their solution. You might have a great idea. There's an app. There's uh, all sorts of cool technologies. But many times it's presented in a way that people feel that, oh, it's just another one of those apps. It's this same business idea that I've heard eight, 10 years ago. Make sure that the demo is really interactive, really cool, well-designed, and that it communicates that this is unique. Maybe it's the same idea as somebody else, but you're better or different in some meaningful way. A lot of people also forget to mention competition. If you have no competition slide or when you go to your Q&A, you say, we are the first of our kind, there's no competitors, investors will feel that you have not done your homework, that you don't really understand your market. And then lastly, investors need to know why you're pitching to them. How much money are you raising? What are you going to use the money for? And how will that money turn into many times uh, growth and return? And what kind of returns can they expect? When are you going to raise your next funding? All this is so important because at the end of the day, companies need funding to sustain, companies need funding to survive. I have been through it all before. I hope that the clips and all the resources that we provide will make sure that you pitch really well and succeed in fundraising. I really look forward to meet y'all in person, support you throughout this Springboard program, and very excited to be working with you.